Hey Shabib, I want to give you an update on Hootsuite since it's been a while since we've worked on it and just uh, as much as I can think of here when you're doing posts, okay? Uh, when you log in, you're going to go to the dashboard area and you can see there's a pending tab here. So that way, while you're working, you can check to make sure things you scheduled um, are going out to the main networks, my favorites, that is. So what I basically do is um, I want you to send everything out to this favorites under this little pull down menu. Um, if you that'll just a shortcut. So if I click favorites, it's going to collect. It's going to select the ones that I want you to send out to. This one here, Caramel. Sometimes I'll ask you to send out to it. And this one right here, Improv, is an Instagram. It's only going to be um, appropriate when there's an image. So a lot of times. If, you're, if, you're, if there isn't an image in the post, then you're going to go down here and you can deselect that. Uh, also, these two um, Twitter accounts are only going to be appropriate if it's 140 characters or less. So if you know it's a really long message, you can just come in here and deselect them like that real quick and deselect uh, this one down here for Instagram when you know there's not a image being attached. Do you have any questions about that? All right, so the other thing is, let's look through here. Again, this is the attach media. You know how to do that. Scheduling, very important to be very careful. It's easy to not press AM or PM and schedule it at the wrong time. Uh, then another thing is under this privacy options, I want to make sure that you go through here and select public on everything, okay? That's a big time saver for me. So all three options, select public. You don't need to do anything with targeting or location, but scheduling and attachment it's great to use this link shrinker because that helps keep it under the number of characters um, down here, you know, 2,000 or less for Facebook. So always use this shrink. And uh, when you're posting something, uh, you know, always add a hashtag in it. And some hashtags you might want to put on a list for you to keep track of are uh, Austin Music, Austin, put like two for every post. Austin Light. Now, if that puts you over the limit for uh, Twitter, then don't do it. But just to keep that in mind, have at least one or two hashtags. You can also put strings attached. You can put pump day happy hour. Okay, so there's four tags that you can always use if there's room available. All right, and let me think of anything else. Just kind of be checking your work as you, as you go by clicking on this pending tab. Let's see, we got off here. Pending, pending. All right, uh, and make sure you know when you schedule something that it appears where it's supposed to have done. Okay, like if it, you know, if it, if it's not, if you if you had one scheduled for three p.m. and didn't come up here, and you actually did it for three a.m., then you go through and you delete and start over. So, and if you kind of mouse over here on the right hand side, it's a very inefficient way of deleting, but you can see it's got this editing button, plus you can delete there as well.